Tigers. It's me with news and other important information. And I'm AJ. Today is election day, so if you're over 18, make sure you head to the polls. And I'm Asher, here with your Tiger Sports. Now here's the news and announcements. You need, need to you, know. You need to know. You're up. Tigers, today's the last day left to sign up for the Rotary Youth Leadership Conference. Complete print and due to Miss Martin no later than today, November 8th. Please come chat with Miss Martin in the Career Office Center if you have any other questions. You can find the application in your class of 2024 and 2025 Google Classroom. This is where you can go to find scholarships. The Slow High Counseling website to watch PowerPoints, go to the Live Link websites, and check out many insights. Check out the Slow HS Scholarship Newsletter for all regional, state, and national champ er, scholarships. Each entry has a live link. Gather all the application materials, transcripts, letters of recommendation, list of honors and awards, and community service logs. Be sure to check out the Community Foundation. Slow County opens December 1st and is due February 1st. Scholarship workshops are at Slow High during Monday Tutorial, December 19th and January 30th. Plan on completing the Slow HS local scholarship application. This application is for Slow High students only and it will be emailed to your student account December 21st and is due on February 22nd. Good luck and the due dates matter. Attention, this is important if you are in a Harvard Model Congress. You must turn in your check for $250 addressed to Slow's ASB by today. If you do not bring in your checks by today, you will not be going to the conference. Please email Mrs. Ritter if you have any interest in, if you are interested in financial aid or have any exuntiating circumstances. Tigers, do you need tutoring to help you prepare for upcoming finals? If so, there is online tu tutoring provided by BrainFuse. Tigers, Canned Food Drive is this week, November 7th through 10th. ASB is here to give you some more info. Spirit points? What's up, Tigers? You want spirit points? I got a whole lot of spirit points, okay? Bring in your, uh, your, your cans to the front of school every morning. Bring them in. You get spirit points. I got a bunch to give out. Spirit points. First, first place gets 200 points. Second place gets 150 points. Third place gets 100 points. And fourth place gets 50 points. Spirit points. Specialty items are worth five times the regular amount of points. We've got stuffing, box mashed potatoes, canned yams, canned soups, and brown sugar. Spirit points. Spirit points. I love spirit points. Bring, Bring in your cans! Do you have questions about college applications? Do you want to find a community service verification form? How about a work permit? All the information you and your parents need are on the counseling department website. Go to the school website, click on Student Services, then Counseling Department. The first black rectangle button next to Mrs. Ingalls will take you to all the answers for your questions. Check it out today or whenever you have questions related to counseling topics. Attention Ceramics students. Have you taken Ceramics 2 or 3? Come join the Ceramics Club on November 10th after school for throwing night. You are encouraged to bring any guest or teacher and teach them how to throw a bowl. The bowls will be donated to charity and community service hours can be earned. Join the Slow HS band tonight at Chipotle from 5 to 9 p.m. just off Madonna. Fundraisers like these help the band organize competitions and repair instruments as well as other things to keep the wheels turning. You will see them in the streets, you see them in the stands, and they'll see you at Chipotle. Key Club meets today at lunch in room 911. They hope to see you there. Calling all future aviators, the Experimental Aviation Association is meeting Sunday, November 20th at noon over the airport at San Luis Avionics on the opposite side of the terminal. Hot dogs and lunch provided. Sam Santos, a slow high graduate, just got back from his training at SkyWest and is waiting for a slot to open up. He'll be talking about the process of getting all the ratings needed to apply to the airlines and training he finished just to fly the regional jets. We have several retired military and airline pilots who attend the meetings and they are always willing to talk to you. 
about what it's like to fly for a living. We also have lots of pilots who fly for fun and can talk about that as well. Tigers, remember to stay on campus this Thursday, November 10th during lunch for our very first open mic of the year. There will be performances by your fellow Tigers and special staff performance too. Don't miss out. This last Saturday, the Slow High Band went down to Pismo Beach for a Pismo Band Review. They performed in a military style parade and won first in class as well as first in musicality, first in drum major, and first in percussion. Uh, the Slow Hitches Band wants to personally thank you guys, the students, for the love and support you have given us at fundraisers and pep rallies. The marching season is now at a close with the end of the trimester. This means you will see much less of our beloved band. But stay tuned for the Christmas parade and Christmas concert. More information soon. Hey Tigers, the Auto Club will be having their final meeting of the trimester this Wednesday at lunch. Please be there as they will be talking about mo some important announcements. Now to Asher with the sports. Hey Tigers, it's Asher here with your Tiger Sports. The only fall sport athletes that are still competing are our cross country team and our girls volleyball team, which is which uh, the volleyball team will be going off to Division II playoffs and they will be playing at Huntington Beach this Tuesday at 6 p.m. Unfortunately, our football team is out of the playoffs, but our marching band came out of a very strong weekend. They got sweepstakes, first in percussion, and first in drum major. Wrestling preseason practices are still happening after school on Tuesdays and Thursdays until 5.30 in the wrestling room. Now back to Tamir and AJ with your lunch in U.S. history. Today's lunch, whether you like it or not, is a surprise. On November 8, 1892, Grover <coughs> Cleveland was elected his second term as president after spending a full term not as president <coughs> and doing this to become the first president to serve two non-consecutive terms. That's all for today, Tigers. It's crazy. Man. See you tomorrow. <laughs>